Welcome back. Well, you can start singing Take Me Out to the Ball Game because baseball season is back and the Gulf Coast Commoners have already begun theirs. Since the Commodores started the season on January 26, they've been on the road. But finally, on Thursday, they'll be back on their home field for the Visit Panama City Beach Kevin Miller Tournament. It's time, you know, we've, we've played five games on the road. It's time for us to, to be at home and sleep in our own beds and uh, see if we can play, play pretty good for the, for the home crowd. Playing at home is extra special for five Commodores players because the home crowd is their hometown crowd. I mean, it's a dream come true playing for your hometown and coming out and playing with all these great guys. And the bonds on this team is just irreplaceable. These players are always appreciative of the fans and getting the win for them is always what they strive to do. I mean, our town's actually been through a lot of stuff and coming out and playing here in front of them with all the donations that we had for our field back in last year when we didn't even really have a field. So going out and playing for them is always a great thing. Gulf Coast head baseball coach Mike Candler said he's happy to have the local talent because they each bring something to the table. You know, we don't ever recruit based on geography, but we do start recruiting, you know, close to home. And if the players are good enough locally and they fit what we need, which that's a big part of it. Sometimes people, why didn't you take this guy? Well, we can't have 12 shortstops out here or whatever it might be. So, um, but if they fit our need and, and they're from here, we'd like to have them. And we've been very fortunate. Panama City High School baseball has been really good for a long time. And we've had some really, really good players from, from the local area. So it works out really well. 